So apparently someone bombed Boston. Uh, a lot of people, you know, people I know personally and people on the internet have been asking me about this and it's just happened. Uh, but regardless, I did find something out about it. Now this is bizarre. A few minutes ago I posted a link to a Facebook page called Thoughts Go Out to All Involved in the Boston Explosions. The page was created two days ago. Within a couple of minutes, not only did the page disappear, but so did my links to that page. But guess what? While I still had the page up on my screen, I photographed it. Better copy and send this around now, because something is very, very wrong here. I can't, um, I can't judge whether it was a false flag attack or not. It's too early. It, it literally just happened today. But I will admit, this is very weird, because this Facebook page was made on Saturday, and it's, uh, Monday right now. So, this is very weird. Um, one, I don't want people to be uh, looking at this page, and then be all, you know, get up on it like this is a false flag. We don't know if it's a false flag or not yet. Um... You know, we can say it's a false flag, but one, we have to wait until what the government does. Because that's the way we can call it a false flag. If they're using it in their power, then we can call it a false flag, sure. Uh, but regardless, this is very strange. Uh, so I'm not asking you guys to jump all over this information. Just um, Just keep it in mind. If the government tries to say anything like it was North Korea or who knows, I mean, just keep this in mind because this page was made two days before. And I'm almost positive we all know about the Sandy Hook, uh, how they had pages for the victims and they had, you know, donations for the victims uh, like a week before it happened. So this is uh, tying together. This page is deleted right now, by the way. But the screenshot is here. You can see it. So, yeah. You know, three bombs went off. Uh, you know, I hope they don't use this for a false flag, though. Because we know the government, and even if they didn't orchestrate it, they, they could use it, you know? Uh, but, again, just because a Facebook page is made, doesn't mean the government did it. It could actually be someone else who did it. You get, We have to think about all possibilities here. But uh, I just wanted to get this video out, um, put it on YouTube. It's circling Facebook right now, but uh, I just wanted to get it out on YouTube to show you that, you know, there is something weird going on. Uh, so yeah, take, what it, take from it what you will. That's all I can say. If you think this message is important and should be viewed by others, please share it. Share it to Facebook, share it to Twitter, also be sure to like and favorite the video. By doing so, it'll rise in listings and you'll have the opportunity to be viewed by others. Help us get the message out to the national and international stage. And also please subscribe to this channel, The Truth is Full of Lies.